Promark drumstick video. This is going to be pretty lengthy because I have a lot of models here, as you can see. This is like my whole collection here. I've been collecting these for a while. Um, I went on eBay and picked some up. Every time I go into Guitar Center, I pick some up. I just order different models. Now, we're only talking Promark today, because that's all I use. I just really like their sticks. It's what I've used ever since I first started playing drums. It was a pair of Promark 5A. We got some stick bags. Now, I got a couple of them here. And I got a couple more on order, too. This one here is the Zildjian Standard. It's got the gold logo on the front. And here is an old Promark Standard with Promark on the front. Now, I have another older Zildjian, a used one, coming in. And it's got the logo going diagonal like I also have another Promark bag coming in that's the new one it has the stripe a logo of the stripe on the front so I really need like three bags to store all these sticks as a drummer you can never have too many sticks I found that the wood tips do break and they break often right here here's a 5a long model and as you can see it has a chip in it and they do chip away so keep that in mind we're going to start off with these joey jordanson these are oak now i believe this is a discontinued model just to give you a really quick history promark used to have say millennium twos down at the bottom and I have some of these old models. Here's an older model here, and it says Millennium 2 at the bottom. They don't say that anymore. Back about, I don't know, back around 2011, Daddario picked up Promark sticks. And as you can see, it says Daddario under there now. Promark still runs the company. It's just, they're just being manufactured by... Dario Strings Corporation. So here is a set. I got two pairs of 515 model Joey Jordanson. And these are oak. Really large round tip. Kind of like these 707s. As you can see, the 707 nylon kind of has that large round tip and I really like these um, I thought these were so cool I, I picked them up and I'm not going to tell you how much I paid for them I got two pairs of the oak and I've got two pairs of the hickory Joey Jordanson 515 hickory USA Hickory. Uh, these are really cool. These are cool sticks. And like I said, I believe that they are discontinued now. So, of course, I'm not going to play on those. Also, in my collection, I got a pair of Hickory 747s. Now, these are really nice. Of course, everyone knows Neil Peart played these, and I'll tell you what, these are, these really are an amazing model. 0.551 shaft, so it's a, essentially it's a 5A, and you get a little bit more length. These are 16 and a quarter long, and it has the tip of a 2B. Very nice model indeed. If you don't play on 747s, I would encourage you to get a pair and try them. And I am telling you that you're going to like them. Now, here's another unique pair I have right here. 
Jay-Z. I believe that stands for jazz. These are oak. See, they have the Promark Daddario name. These are PW. JZW. Not really sure, but JZ, I'm thinking that stands for jazz. W stands for wood tip. These are about the size of a 7A. But a 7A is a little bit shorter than these, as you can tell. These are the size of a 7A. Just a little bit longer. It's got the same tip, just a little bit of extra length. These are pretty nice, and I have a hard time finding these models, too. I don't believe I will be playing on those, either. Here's a model that I just picked up. I actually just got it in today. This is a 727. It's a little bit bigger than a 7A, but it's smaller than a 5A. A nice, a standard oval tip, you know, like you would find on a 5A. So, that was a different model that they had to offer. So, I picked that up. I got two pairs of 747 Neil Peart signatures. Oak. They're incredible. These 747s, they handle like a 5A give you a little bit of extra length and it's got a nice large oval tip uh, these are expensive but they're very nice so if you can get a couple pairs to throw in your collection I would highly recommend that maybe actually everybody should have two pairs of Neopark signatures in their bag or at least just get the regular 747s possible now here is another discontinued stick model the 707 these are hickory I also have a pair of oak these have been discontinued when I figured that out I was actually gonna play on these because these are actually my favorite model right here it has a really large round tip See that? I mean, you get all kinds of bite on your hi-hat and your snare. They're incredible. They feel like a 5A, but they just got that large round tip. And these are very, very nice, but they don't make these anymore. So, I'm putting these away. And I will probably never play on them. Moving along, another model that I just got in today, 747. Now, these have nylon tips. They've also redesigned, see it says born in Japan. They've kind of redesigned the look, um, their print a little bit. Now they've, they've updated it, if, if, if you would, their print. Shirakashi Oak Attack 747. Then on the back it says Born in Japan. This is the Japanese Oak. <coughs> this is the stick of sticks right here. Um, like I say, uh, 747 has become my favorite. Neil Peart played on him, I think, his whole career. And um, I see why. I see why. So that is my unique pairs right there. And um, now I'm going to move on to some standard uh, sticks. I've got a whole bunch of 5As. They're a standard. You know, if, if you don't know what to pick, go with 5A. I really like the nylon tips. These are wood tips. Matter of fact, I would suggest that if you don't know where to go, start with these and uh, 
try the nylon tips because the nylon tips last a long time. I've had some nylon tips for years. I bought a six pack and it just it lasted me many many years. These are the Dodario 5A wood tip. Standard 16 inch long, you know. I think everybody pretty much plays on that. Now, I also have a pair of classic 5A long. These are kind of funny. I found these on Amazon. They were used. It was a return, so I got them at a really special price. And um, they're brand new, like absolutely perfect. So there are 5A long. I also have four pairs of the Hickory 5A wood tip naturals. The naturals are really nice. They don't put any lacquer on them. It kind of gives you a different feel. Uh, they're not perfectly smooth like the oaks. They're a little bit more coarse. Really actually kind of neat. And I have I have four pairs of those. I would say, you know, if you're a lover of the 5As, get you some naturals too and try them out. I also have two pairs of the Fire Grain. These ones came out, I don't know, five years ago. These are a little expensive because they go through another process where they uh, put these in the oven and they, they, they fire them, burn them. Supposedly, it gives them a little bit more strength. I don't know. Fire grains, they're, they're expensive. Um, the color is beautiful. They really are beautiful looking. And that's that. Now, the 5As are great because, like I say, that's, just, that's a standard. That is a standard model. Now, I do have a lot of 7As. 7As are nice, too, if you're going to play light music, okay? If you're going to play jazz, this is your stick here, okay? Because you will break them. And I'm just letting you know. Now, I would not um, count these out now. These are perfect for if you're, if you're going to play light, very, very soft music. Like in the club, let's say a restaurant or something where you're required to play absolutely quiet. The, this is all you need right here. You don't need no more than a 7A. But if you go beating on these, you are going to break them. <clears throat> Here's an old pair. See, it says Millennium 2's up at the top. These are the old Millennium 2's. I found those on eBay. Millennium 2 at the bottom. Uh, these are oak. These ones are hickory. So we got hickories. Millennium 2's at the top. Oak. Millennium 2's at the bottom. We got hickory again. Another pair of hickory. Looks like I got three pairs of... Two pairs of hickory. And four pairs of oak. You got a lot of oak. It says Millennium 2 at the bottom. And here's the pair of Daddario. See? The Daddario company makes them now. A pair of 7As is really nice for light jazz, easy listening, and low volume situations. And uh, if I was going to get a pair, I would go with the Oak. The Oaks are perfectly smooth, and they are just absolutely beautiful. You can see all the wood grains in it. Perfectly smooth and they're strong. They're a little bit more strong than hickories. So, those are going to go in another bag I got coming in. Plus, I also have a bunch of pairs of 7A hickory nylon tips that are at the studio. I'm going to bring those back because, like I say, I'm, we're playing metal and those sticks are breaking and 
I'm not going to have that. Now, I've got a collection of sticks that are actually in my bag currently. And we're going to start right off with the Neil Perts. These are the sticks of sticks. You get the Neil Perts, you're going to have plenty of power. And these are not going to break. These are the oak, and they're just very, very nice. And along with that, of course, got a couple pairs of 5A wood tip. These are also oak. I love oak. Oak sticks. Another way to go. And um, I've got this model 707, which is an, also an oak. Remember, it's got that large round tip. And these are actually my favorite pair. And unfortunately, they don't make these anymore. So I think I'm actually probably going to take these out of the set. And I'm going to um, just keep them at home because they don't make these anymore. And <clears throat> lastly, like I showed you with the broken wood tip, I got a pair of Promark 5A Long. And these acorn tips... I find to be amazing on e-drums. Now, let me tell you what. If you have mesh heads on your e-drums, use brand new sticks that have never been that you've never played because you want nice smooth tips that don't have splinters because it it can rip your mesh heads. I only like to play on Promark. Uh, I have had some pairs of Vix, uh, you know, and Vic Verth's very nice sticks, you know. But I just prefer to use Promark 